Alright. I don't know what, if how I if I can fix that at all, but yeah. I don't know. It, like sometimes it doesn't do it, sometimes it does. And yeah. Anyways. Anyways, what you saw there with the uh, Sonic, Sonic the Hedgehog popping up, uh, you got this on the, on the list. Uh, basically, uh, I believe this... I don't think this was in the original version, but... Yeah, DX introduces, um, like, the minigame collection, which is basically a bunch of game... A bunch of the Game Gear Sonic games. I don't... I don't think it was all of them, but it was quite a, f quite a few. Um, and bas basically, you get, like, I think around 20 emblems. And after after you get like after every twenty emblems, you get a new Game Gear Sonic game, and then uh, you can do missions to get even more of them. So it's a pretty cool bonus, actually. Like you get not only do you get a pretty meaty three uh, D Sonic game, but you get like a healthy amount of like Game Gear stuff, which. Uh, a lot, mo I, I guess a lot of people aren't like the biggest fan of a lot of the Game Gear games, but it's some of the games like uh, like the Sonic One. I don't know if Sonic Two's on here, but there's the I think Sonic Chaos and all that. Like the, I'll have to check the list, but since you're on a TV screen, uh, the screen crunch isn't. Like nearly as bad. I don't know. I don't know if there there is screen crunch on on the on the mini game on the Game Gear games here because yeah, you you are playing on a TV, so I'd assume not, but I can't guarantee anything. But yeah, uh, we completely skip the platforming section entirely and just go to the uh, just the snowboarding section because yeah. Again, this is pretty much just an abridged version of Sonic Story. Which, I mean, I don't mind too much because it's, it goes by pretty fast and it's fun to play as Tails like flying around and stuff, so I don't I don't mind too much that it's a, uh, a, uh, just a, basically a copy and paste of Sonic Story, but I, it would have been better if, he, if Tails had more of his own stages, because when he does, it's really so fun to go through like these different pathways that you haven't seen before, but since we're, most of it is just Sonic, through Sonic's perspective really, uh, this is just like the same stuff we've seen, really. But there's no difference from this, uh, from Sonic. But it's still fun to play. I will say I think this is one of the best. Uh, uh, what is it? Oh, grab the emerald. <laughs> that would suck if I lost be just because I passed it past the emerald. Yeah. Also, have I mentioned that this game is really easy? <laughs> like there are some. There are moments of challenge, like especially if you're going for the emblems and stuff. But really, there isn't. There are, but like the bosses are pathetic most of the time. Uh, well, yeah, like the only one that I can say kind of uh, can kind of that kind of gives you a challenge is Chaos Two with Knuckles. But that's because it's kind of it's not really clear where you when you should hit him. But um. Trying to punch you. What do you? What did? It, what does it look like? Uh, top of the knuckles. The rest of the best of them. <laughs> um, I don't know. Yeah. But yeah, tails. Uh, the the tail attack isn't really that useful now because it only lasts like a second. It's kind of like the inst. It's kind of like the Insta, sh Insta Shield in that way, like not in how it performs. Like they both perform differently, but yeah, in terms of like how long it lasts, it, it gets a lot better when we get a certain power up. But um, 
you yeah. are Most of the time you'll just be flying over everything anyway. <laughs> Again. I wasn't too keen on this fight with Sonic and unfortunately Tails is no different. It's basically just the exact same fight. The only thing is that Tails has to hit Chaos like one, one less time. Uh, yeah, this is just... I have nothing to say about Chaos 4, I'm sorry. Like, I, I said what I needed to with Sonic. Just... Why'd you have to fight this guy so many times? <sighs> and I guess you can kind of say that Chaos 6 is just as bad because you fight him three times as well. But the difference with that is that one uh, with a uh, one of those times is big, and that <laughs> that lasts like five seconds, if even that. And also, it goes by a lot faster, and it's a lot fun. It's a lot more fun to fight Chaos Six than Four. Uh, yeah, this just this just goes on forever. And it, again, most of, most of the time, he doesn't bother doing his uh, actually interesting attacks. It's just like the same stuff, over and over, and until he decides to just go to the surface, please, there we go, there we go. <laughs> that looks really weird. Now we have this cutscene again. Yeah. It seems to have just happened during cutscenes. Oh man, but yeah, have to do this again. What the hell? The cutscene should have activated. That was, that was weird. Sonic, wait here for a second. I like how they had to sense tails jumping in. Like what? <laughs> what?
Honestly, I feel like they should have cut these like stages out for Tails because there's no difference with the Sky Chase levels from Sonic to Tails because it's literally the same. You're going through the same pathway because uh, you don't exactly control where the tornado is going. Like you control the movement here, but that's only for aiming and stuff. The the way like where you're going doesn't change from stories. From Sonic and Tails and stories. So I honestly feel like they should have cut these out because it's I, I, I think these these stations are fine uh what playing through these with Sonic like one time but what when you have to play the exact same sky chase levels um both twice it kind of makes them lose their luster and it's not really they're nowhere near as fun to play as when they were the first time so I honestly feel like they should have cut these out with Tales of Story because they offer nothing new like it's not even like with uh, the like Windy Valley or any of the Sonic the stages that had uh, that was for Sonic's story uh, like those stages at least had you play as uh, Tails and he plays differently from Sonic and they don't last too long but with this it's the exact same thing. There's no gameplay differences. There's no length differences. There's no difficulty uh, differences or anything like that. It's point for point the same thing. So, yeah. I don't really see the point in having this here. Like, it's really just there for padding. Nothing more. And again, I uh, these levels are fine, but not for... Not, I don't... I don't really want care to play these stages four times, you know? But, yeah. This one's not too long. It's the, se the second one that's really more offensive, in a way, if you will. Because that one lasts for quite some time. Yeah. And another thing about it is that with Tails, um, there's only, like, one small, uh, like a sub level or whatever after this with Tails and then a straight to Sky, straight to Sky Chase Act 2. That doesn't really help. We did it. And this happens again. Yeah, I tried to make it look like this target is the cannon firing just because. It's a little bit too high, but yeah. Because the tornado can apparently survive a barrage of lasers from Metal Sonic, but not one laser from the Egg Carrier. Like, either that cannon is, like, stupid powerful, or Metal Sonic may be weak. Dream brought back memories. I owe so much to Sonic. Sonic! Hmm. Wonder where he went. Sure hope he's alright. The tornado's not powerful enough. If I'm gonna get that egg carrier, I need to finish my prototype. 
It needs a chaos emerald to work. Looks like I'd better find one fast. Yeah. And funnily enough, the yeah. the trains aren't like working at this time. Just how f how freaking convenient, man. Also, yeah, there are NPCs that you can talk to in the hub worlds, but I never really cared to. Like, there aren't any type like type of town missions or anything to wor worry about, and you don't get anything from them. Like, you can There are some interesting stories that go on, I guess, but I just don't really care care that much. One thing I do know is that there is this kid that you, you see a couple of times called like the Mister Know It All or something, and he just tells you. Stuff general stuff about the game so yeah if you need like tips or anything just talk to him because he does show up a considerable amount of times especially with Sonic alright yeah and this is one of the two stages that's actually unique from t for Tails well not exactly like in terms of like the actual stage itself but I mean the this is well this is the only stage that's unique for Tails in that sense but there's another the last stage was in Sonic's campaign as well but you're going for a different pathway for the most part so yeah but yeah this is pretty it's pretty much just uh like uh yeah excuse me it's it's basically like ice cap again but you're just going through these little uh like Goal things or whatever you'd call these, but yeah, th this doesn't last for too long. It's basically just a little mini game in a sense. Like the it, the game even calls it a sub game or whatever it was, a sub level, and it's already done. Not even fi not even fifty seconds. It is a fun little stage though. And now we're in the area that Sonic was in, except he was... Sonic was in this part of, this, of, this, of the area, except it was in flames and stuff. And you can still go here with Tails, but... Whatever. Anyways, though, here's the uh, power-up we can get. I think you actually have to get this side. I don't think uh, Takawa appears if you, uh, you if you don't edge. get this. To do continuous tail attacks, hold the action button down. So yeah, that's basically it. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> the servers are the seven chaos emeralds. Hello there, friend. How are you? Um, what were you saying before? Huh. It's something my grandmother taught me. I'm never to forget it. It goes like this. The servers are the seven chaos. Chaos is power. Power enriched by the heart. The controller is the one that unifies the chaos. But I'm still not sure what it all means. But the number seven... is the same as the number of emeralds there are. Emeralds? Forgive me, but I don't think we've ever met before. I'm to call, and you are? Never answers. <laughs> Yeah. 
thing is go through go through Froggy because that's not gross at all. Yeah. <laughs> 